Hey guys, so this is K-Pop Mart. It's one of the Korean uh, websites that you can buy things from. They also have fashion, beauty, drama, and all K-Pop type goods. I was just going to take you guys through the website a little bit. So if you want to buy from here, you kind of already know what you can do. They usually right here keep the newest albums that came out, as well as, you know, the newest goods, TV shows, and any beauty, fashion type goods you want to get. They also have, you can shop here off the side, what their most bought or popular album is will usually be right here. But we're going to go to the K-pop goods. And then they kind of break it down for you. But they do sell autographed albums. They are, probably the site will probably have the most expensive albums. As you can tell, they're going to roughly be around $100 just for a signed album. So it's probably cheaper to buy them off the other websites or off of eBay. But you can get it here. A nice thing about this site is you can actually buy the official posters separate from the albums. So if you didn't want to get the album but you really like the poster or if yours ripped, you can buy the posters here. Yeah, it looks like they're roughly about two dollars. And then let's just go to one of the groups. Let's just look at BAP's new album. This is kind of how they have it set up. If you're a member, which you probably should be, or have an account, you'll get loyalty points and they kind of tell you what they convert to. So how much you'll get like 20 cents if you buy this album. And then here you can choose, they'll have their different options. They'll have a tubed poster, uh, folded poster, or no poster at all. Sometimes they don't give you the three options. Sometimes you just get it in a tube or not. And then down here they talk about the album. They'll have like uh, pictures sometimes. Uh, let's see. They should have one. Here maybe let's look at newest album. Uh, sometimes the new stuff doesn't have all the photos. Here we go to winners since there's two versions. we will kind of tell you here what you'll be buying and that it is your purchase will go to the charts. So like with this one, there's two versions, so they're going to show you what both version sets would technically look like and come with. Like with the boxes, photo books, and all the goods inside you'll get. And then, depending on which version you pick, this is the poster you'd get. One thing I like about this site is it's roughly price-wise to K-Town for use. It's a couple dollars more. I did compare the price for this album. On K-Town right now, I think it's about $12, and here it's $14, and Yes Asia has it for $18. That's if you pick the version you want. Um, the shipping with this company is a little bit more expensive than Yes Asia's shipping or K-Town's shipping. I usually get free shipping with Yes Asia because I spend their $39 minimum. So it kind of makes the albums even out price wise with these websites. Um, but the nice thing this site does is they actually give you a photo. Like when they ship your package, they take a picture of all the stuff in the box. So you can make sure that they are actually shipping you the items and the albums that you ordered. So you won't be getting accidental wrong albums or versions or things like that. You can confirm it right then and there. So I will post a picture of the one they sent me when I ordered. I got was B1A4's Sweet Girl albums. So this site, I don't think it's as popular. I never really hear about it as much as some of the other sites. So they do have some older albums that are out of stock in a lot of places. Like the Sweet Girl ones, I thought I wasn't going to be able to get them. Like I could only get them on eBay, but they were still on here. So that's why I picked them. 
So if you guys have any questions about this site, just let me know. I've only bought an, on here one time, so I don't know too, too much about it, but I'd be more than happy to look up some questions that you have, the answers for them, and then for the unboxing of what their stuff looked like when they shipped it to me. Okay guys, so this is going to be the box from the K-Pop Mart. I'm going to break down my cost of everything in here. I only got a couple albums because they did cancel some of the other ones because they couldn't get them. But they do tape it to the box after they bubble wrap it, I guess. Which is like the dumbest thing ever. There we go. Okay, so I only ended up getting two because they canceled the rest. And they taped them together as well. I can put this slide it up. So, yeah. I got oh my gosh. Should have just cut it all away. As you can tell, I got Sweet Girl B1A4s. This is the boy version. And they're the only site, this is actually the only site that still had these where you could buy them. I was pretty surprised because most of the other sites just said random. And since I already had one of the versions, I didn't want a chance getting it again. So I already had the flower edition, so this is the butterfly and the boy version. They ended up costing me uh, $14.90 for each one. Shipping was about $11.80, so my total came out to be $41.60 for just these two. The shipping is pretty, it's more expensive than the other sites I've bought from so far. And you don't get tracking for that for about that cost. And like K-Town for you, I could have gotten the tracking information. But I did order it on December 16th. They didn't ship it till December 28th. And I just got it here in Michigan in the United States on January 19th is when it got here. And if you did get tracking, like if you upgraded to the more expensive shipping... So your tracking number would be on the box, and that's how you would track your package. Like, they don't just put it in the email. And I think that's really pretty much it. I hope you guys like these reviews. But let me know, or if there's a site in particular you'd like to see me review or have my opinion on. Just let me know in the comments below. And until the next video, bye guys!